very own WGN Evening News at 6. Well, more complaints about major delays in mail delivery. Local postal officials blame the problem on short staffing due to COVID absences. But angry customers say no more excuses. It's time to do something about it. WGN's Gaynor Hall is live on the south side with that story. Gaynor. Ray and Mike, the spokesperson for the Postal Service says they are continuously adjusting staffing as customers say the problems with the mail persist. Every time y'all put in the tracking number, it shows at the reception desk at the post office. Tired of waiting at home this week, Dion Bostic went to the Auburn Park Post Office. I stood in line for almost 45, 50 minutes before I was able to even get on the inside to speak to a representative just to find out that, no, we're not giving out packages. And she's not alone. Complaints continue to come in from across the city, people waiting for mail, checks, medicine. It's just ridiculous. And then to see the pile of mail that's outside their facility. Images of mounting mail outside Mount Greenwood's post office have been circulating on social media. Lori Cross says her mail comes once about every two weeks, and when it does arrive, it's at night. We're short this, we're COVID this, and COVID that. Quit blaming the pandemic and do something about it. And that's the problem. Nobody is doing anything about it. On the far north side, Congresswoman Jan Schakowsky says she received nearly 100 calls over the Thanksgiving weekend about mail service. People are beside themselves. She says Postal Service leadership told her they would reassign eight letter carriers to the problem areas in her district and are working to hire more. It's been very, very difficult for people um, who are, you know, really dependent right at this moment, this COVID moment, um, for help from the Postal Service. So we need to deal with this. Union leaders say the problems predate the pandemic. It's just some bad operational decisions that were being made in Chicago, late starting times, not properly staffing these offices. COVID has just really exposed um, the understaffing uh, in the district. He says he is cautiously optimistic, though, that the Postal Service is finally acknowledging those problems and addressing them with more hiring. Reporting live tonight from the Auburn Gresham neighborhood, Gaynor Hall, WGN News. Thanks, Gaynor. President